Hello everybody, this is your one only ball officer 77 and in today's video guys we're going to be taking a look at something really, really cool for MSPC guys so let's just get started sharp in the video so guys in today's video we're going to be taking a look at another awesome epic amazing banger mod for MSPC guys in today's video we're taking a look at the furniture mod for MSPC guys let's just get started sharp in the video so guys before we do start this video um, I do want to apologize for being a little bit inconsistent on my YouTube channel. Hopefully you guys haven't tuned out. Uh, hopefully you guys are still here. If you guys aren't, um, you know, I don't know what to say. <laughs> Just like, I guess, um, come back, please. Please, I beg you. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, man. Um, don't worry, guys. I am still on the channel. I'm still uploading regularly. Regularly. Not as regularly consistent as I was before, but I am starting to upload again more and more. Um, I, I do I apologize for being a little bit um, inconsistent on my uploads. I've just been really struggling to keep this up. But don't worry, guys. I'm going to eventually be able to continue uploading. And once the breaks do come, the winter and the fall break, you guys will be seeing me you know, upload like more and more, way more, like probably almost every day on during the break time so yeah just keep that note in mind uh, just in case you guys are curious but yeah man let's just get started sharpening this video so guys before we do start this video let's see if we can hit an amazing like goal of 69 likes on this video guys if we can hit 69 likes on this video that honestly mean the world to me so let's let me try and smash that like button guys also guys if you guys are new to the channel and you haven't even subscribed come on man what are you doing with your life you got to subscribe to the channel for some epic amazing banger content guys i promise you guys will not regret it whatsoever with that being said without further ado let's just get Get started straight up in the video all right so you guys can see in today's video we're going to be taking a look at the furniture mod slash add-on for mcp you see guys this mod is a pretty self-explanatory mod basically what this is i believe this is called Ushak or Umar or something like that. Sorry, I forgot the name of the creator of this mod, but yeah, uh, whoever the creator was, I believe it was named Ushak or Umar. I, I, I don't even know what the name was, but yeah, it's basically that name and then the furniture add-on. That's the name of this add-on. So yeah, guys, it's a pretty cool add-on overall. Basically, essentially what it adds is, um, you know, a bunch of different furniture. You'll see like tech and, you know, like kitchen items, stuff like that. Uh, stuff you would typically ex expect in the, you know, like a furniture mod slash add-on for MCP. So, you guys, uh, in order to actually, you know, obtain these items, you actually do... Okay, before you, before I say that, in order to actually uh, get the mod to work, you guys do have to uh, download the .mc add-on file. And then all you guys got to do is just import it to your local Minecraft. And then uh, all you guys got to do now is just pretty much go to your... Uh, create a new world... Go to resource packs, make sure you enable the resource pack, and then go to behavior packs and enable the re uh, behavior pack. And then once you guys have done that, go to go back to game, and then scroll down until you see an option that says use experimental game. But you guys want to make sure that is checked and uh, marked enabled. Uh, if you guys do want this mod to obviously work, otherwise this mod is not going to work. So that is an extremely crucial, essential step that you guys must do. But yeah, man. Uh, that being said, that's pretty much how you install the mod. And then all you guys got to do is create the world, and then you should be pretty much good to go. Um, but yeah, man, that's pretty much that. Pretty, pretty cool stuff. It's nothing too hard, uh, nothing too simple. And of course, if it's not an MC add-on file, you guys will have to download the texture pack and the resource pack individually. But yeah, it's pretty self-explanatory. I'm pretty sure you guys know how to do this. I'll probably make a tutorial and stuff on how to, you know, work this out and stuff if you guys ever encounter any issues like this, just in case you guys are curious. Um, but yeah, man, that's pretty much that. So this is how the add-on does look. We have multiple different furnitures in this mod. We got like fans, trash cans, bins, all that stuff. We got, uh, I think like a microwave. We don't have a TV, I believe. I don't remember seeing a TV. I think it is a part of like a furniture set or something like that. Like you have a cabinet and then a TV attached to it, but you don't have a TV like individually. I don't know if you guys can understand what I'm saying. Uh, same thing with the computer. I think the computer is attached to a table, a specific table. You can't actually like individually put uh, like a co th that computer that in and out of itself uh, just because it is i don't know what why but that's just kind of how it is and i guess um you know when you do have like a table or something you kind of want to put a computer i mean typically a computer usually goes on the table like a bedroom table or something uh, but yeah man you still do have a table with like a dining table and stuff um yeah i mean what, what am i even saying <laughs> But yeah, I mean, that's pretty much that. I don't really got much to say about this mod. It's honestly a really amazing mod. Uh, if you guys want, like I said, I'll leave a link in the description below if you guys would like to go and download this. 
and I will also as well leave a link to the creator if you guys want to go check him out. Uh, definitely go check out the creator if you guys haven't. Uh, just show the creator some support, um, and I'm pretty sure the creator would very much appreciate that. Um, and especially for taking the time to actually, you know, make a mod for Minecraft. Most people, we don't have many mod makers in Minecraft Bedrock Edition, so it's kind of nice to see that we're getting some add-ons for Minecraft, um, at least Bedrock Edition. But yeah, um, but yeah, man, I don't, I don't really got much else to say. It's a pretty self-explanatory mod. I figured it'd be a cool mod. Um, you guys will notice uh, the only downside of this mod is you will notice uh, all these uh, things are actually entities. So they're not act they're they're basically like mobs. So basically, if you tap on the screen, it's basically gonna uh, kill the mob. Or if you click, it's gonna kill the mob. So this is this is basically a mob that just doesn't move. It's not actually you know like an actual block type of furniture. It's just an it's just a mob. So if you you can actually kill it, um, so you don't actually if you want to get rid of it, you don't break it. You have to literally kill it with your sword or weapon or whatever. Um, I think it takes like two hits or something like that, uh, in case you accidentally tap it, which is pretty good. Um, what else do I gotta say? I don't really got much to say about this. Is pretty much it. Like, yeah, guys, I, I didn't really come prepared with uh, commentary or anything like that, so I do kind of apologize, guys. Uh, hopefully, you guys can kind of bear with me. Um, yeah, man, it's been such a long time since, not been such a long time, but, you know, I haven't been doing it as consistently, so it's, you know, a little bit harder for me to, like, process what I'm saying and stuff, so I, I don't know. Um, but yeah, man, also, guys, uh, what you guys can do is, if you guys actually want to obtain these items, uh, you, you won't, you actually have to go on the search bar and the creative inventory, and then you just type in, uh, that little, like, um, you, you do shift nine, and then you should get that weird, like, that weird, uh, like, half circle button that semicircle button or if you guys are on android or ios it's that semi uh semi circle button or whatever you guys uh, you guys have probably already seen it on the screen right now but from the background footage but yeah guys that's pretty much that that's pretty much it for the video i hope you guys did enjoy this video if you guys want to see more videos like this definitely do let me know in the comment section below and also guys i do kind of apologize for also not replying to comments as much i will definitely be replying to comments today as of when i'm done with this video um so yeah guys uh also guys uh, if you guys want me to, like I said, if you guys want me to make more videos like this, or if you guys have an, any idea of what you can want me to do on this channel, then definitely let me know in the comment section below. I was also considering making a modded survival, so if you guys want to go also are into that kind of stuff. I know a lot of you guys aren't, uh, into that kind of stuff. I know a lot of you guys like more, like, shaders, mods, texture packs, stuff like that on my channel for me to be showcasing. But if you guys want me to do, like, a series or something, a Let's Play series... Uh, you know, I don't know, maybe with some YouTubers or something, then definitely let me know in the comment section below. I'd definitely be willing to do that. If I ever were to do a survival series, it'd probably be like a modded survival, definitely. And that would be pretty badass if I do say so myself, but... Yeah, I mean, I don't really know what else to say, but yeah, man, that's pretty much it for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. I want to thank you for joining us for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out, guys. See you. Bye-bye.